what's good what's good back with a new video so um i want to get on a topic about masturbation because i see a lot of people talking about that and um i just want to give my experience from masturbating i started masturbating real early man probably when i was like maybe 12 13 or 12 like i started real early doing that shit what's up bro and um I got hooked on it, bro. Like, <laughs> the first time I ever felt that, you know, it was just like, it was a feeling you never felt before. And you know how it, it's just like fucking a girl that you, you want to fuck and you, you, you know, she bad and she look good, she smell good. Like, it was that feeling the first time I ever did it. And just like, like, you can do this all day, like all the time you can do this. And, you know, it was just like, you don't need nobody. You don't need help to do that. That's you. And it kind of, it kind of just like, it, 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 it got so bad, man. I just stopped masturbating about maybe three months ago. I just stopped masturbating. Like now, if I masturbate, it's like once every other month. Like. When I say I just stopped, it was that's mean like I just, you know, stopped on the way, the path that I was going with it. You know what I'm saying? Like I was doing it 24-7, you know. And um, finally I learned to control it. And, and I realized, man, like you have so much more energy to do things. Like when you masturbate, bro, it fucking drains you. It's not like having sex. That's the fucking crazy thing. Having sex drain you, but masturbating, it's like it take everything from you. And for me, it was bad, y'all. Like I used to masturbate at school, work. I tell you one time, man, I pulled over side of the road and fucking like I was driving, man, and I was. I'm on my way to go have sex with a girl. It's like 7 p.m. You know what I'm saying? Like it's like kind of night, but not really night. I'm so fucking horny. I pulled over, not on the side of the road, but in the middle. You know, like when people get ready to turn off or some shit. Like, how do I explain this? It's like the middle. You know what I'm saying? It's the middle of the highway. That's I mean that's the best way I can explain it. So I pulled over right there, parked my shit, popped me a video on, and fucking masturbated. Like, when I did that, bro, I knew I had an addiction. And I kid y'all not, I been knew I had this type of addiction. And I told my parents like a long time ago, but they never believed me. They never thought it was, I was like, bro, there's something wrong with me. Because, like, I, like my, my, my city drive is, like, you know what I'm saying? Everybody ain't got that. Everybody ain't got that type of sex drive. And, you know, that's understandable. Everybody different. I work out a lot, so therefore, my sex drive going to be high. Because, I mean, I'm constantly building testosterone. You know what I'm saying? I'm always working on my legs. And that's another thing. If you work out, guys, work on your legs. Do legs twice a week. You'll see the results. But, so, I'm always building testosterone, man. So, my hormones are always through the roof. Until I found my purpose. Now, this is this, this is the thing. Once you find what you want to do in life, you can take that masturbation. And that's how I end up losing my, my drive for masturbating. I found something that I love. And I in the time that I would take to masturbate, you take that time and that energy. Because, once again, once you masturbate, it drains you. It takes everything from you. So, how I was able to stop masturbating was I found my purpose. What I like to do in life, what I love, you know what I'm saying? Helping kids, making videos by working out, helping kids and doing things um, with, with the projects that I got going on. That, would, that, that right there helped me to stop doing it, you know what I'm saying? But before that, oh man, it, it happened out of nowhere, bro. Watching a movie, taking a piss, taking a shower. You know what I'm saying? Like, you, you, it was so bad, man. It was so bad. And like I said, man, 
me driving home one day, pulling over on the side of the road, pulling, not on the side of the road, but pulling in the middle of the highway to fucking jack off. Like, I really like, man, this shit is fucking bad. It's bad. So, you know, my, my whole point on masturbating, man, that shit ruins you, man. It takes a lot out you. It drains you. You don't want to do anything after you masturbate, man. Like, when you masturbate, you just want to. You just get all lazy and all that shit. And, you know, you can go on and on and on. And, you know, like, guys, the more you masturbate, the more you lose of yourself, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, a lot of people don't understand this, but there's blood in semen. You know what I'm saying? When you lose semen, man, you're losing life. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's why sex is so valuable, who you connect with, man. Because, you, you you know, uh, <laughs> what, what crazy is... I started masturbating at 11. I'm 27 now. I've been masturbating a long time. And I'm talking about four, five times a day. You feel me? Like four or five times a day I was doing that shit. Even when I was in relationships. Like I can go have sex with a motherfucker and still masturbate. Like that shit was so fucking bad, man. Finally was able to kick that habit. You know what I'm saying? And, and like I said, the only way to kick that habit, you got to find something you love. If you don't find nothing that you love that, that can take your energy and your attention away from that, like, bro, porn is nothing to me, you know? You know what I'm saying? I don't I don't even watch porn, you know what I'm saying? Like, porn and all that shit will ruin you, man. It'll fuck you up. Masturbating, watching that stuff, you know, it take, it, it drains you. You feel me? And that's why a lot of you guys can't be compatible and happy with females. Because you're watching something that you're never going to see, but yet you won't. You're never going to see it in real life, but that's what you want. Because you've been watching that since you was a little boy. You know what I'm saying? So, it kind of like fuck your psyche up, man. And fuck what you think is real. You know, it's real, but it's it's real for them people. Like uh, those actors, you know what I'm saying? Actors and actress, they, they create a script for you. You know what I'm saying? Yet, some people actually get that stuff in real life. You know what I'm saying? I will say that. Some of us, we actually get that in real life. But yet, some of y'all are never going to see that type of stuff. Some of y'all are never going to see that type of sexual desire from a woman. Because, you know, once you're not working on yourself. Two, you're not building no, you know, no, no type of status for yourself. You feel me? So, you're never going to experience that. You feel me? But if you, if you go work on yourself... Get yourself right. I promise you, you'll see it. It's going to be somebody that give you the same type of stuff, but it'll be new, and it'll be it'll be fresh, and it'll be exciting. It's not going to be really exciting if you've been watching that shit all your life. You know what I'm saying? Like me, bro, I done done so much sexual stuff. I done done so many sexual things. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I done done so much, and that's why it's like now... You know what I'm saying? I don't get excited about basic shit. And I tell one of my females all the time, bro, you got to surprise me. My, num my, my number one, she, I tell her, I, we just had this talk. Surprises. Pull up at my job and, and be like, just take that motherfucker. Don't ask me. You can't ask me for sex. That's, uh, you know what I'm saying? Because I done done so much. A female asking me to fuck, it's like, I want you to take my shit. You know what I'm saying? Because that's what I'm going to do. I don't ask no woman for no pussy. You know, I don't ask the fuck a woman. You know what I'm saying? I don't ask no female to get... If I got to ask you to give me head or anything like that, or anything sexual, you're not meant for me. You're not meant for me. I don't... What am, what am I doing talking to you? You know what I'm saying? So, but it's still on the, on the top, man. Masturbate, man. It takes all that. You don't have a sex drive. You're not going to be good in bed, man. You know, even... I, I don't know. It might be because I was in the gym, but I hear a lot of people say... You know, they masturbation, they not that good in bed because, you know, they in a fucking, they so used to 30 seconds. You feel me? That should have ruined you, you know? And, you know, you need your, you need that, that's the, the, the thing that you put in, the energy, the energy that you put into masturbating, that's the energy you need to create a better you. Like, it's that energy, because that energy is so fucking powerful, man, like, that masturbating energy is so fucking powerful. It's insane, bro. That energy right there, 
that sexual energy, I think that one that gotta be one of the most powerful energy in the world. Because you take that energy and you can create a fucking awesome you. You know what I'm saying? So stop masturbating, man. That shit it, it, it ruins you, man. And you know, it, it takes a lot out of you. It take it take it take you down. It don't help you. You know, and that's what I'm 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 so in love with. What don't do nothing that's not gonna benefit you in the long run. You know, good for the heart. Everything you do in life, making sure it's good for the heart. And that's why I love giving. That's why I love helping. That's why I'm, I'm making these videos now. That's why I'm getting more comfortable because I realize I got to be able to talk to y'all. Y'all got to hear my story. I got some deep stories. We're going to get into that later on. But right now, I just want to give you a little quick feedback, man, on my thoughts and, and, and me. You know what I'm saying? Who... Who I am and the things that I've been through instead of man, somebody else, you know, always playing over my videos or my workout videos. So, masturbating, it don't help. It kills you. It takes you down through the, yeah, it's fun for the moment. But, bro, that, what's easy for now going to be hard later. If you do what's hard now, life could be easy later. You know what I'm saying? So, if y'all get that, that means stop masturbating. You know what I'm saying? It, it, it might seem hard, but... It's really not. It really not. All you gotta do is just stop. Find you a purpose though, cause I mean that that what it really gonna take. Find you a purpose. Find you something that you wanna do deeply. Take that energy when you when you think you wanna have sex, when you think you wanna masturbate. Take that energy and put it into what you wanna do and watch what happen. You gonna you gonna do shit. You gonna have the energy and the power to do shit. You gonna glow. You gonna look good. You know what I'm saying? You gonna it's just gonna be all over you, bro. And people gonna notice it. You know what I'm saying? So, y'all check that out, man. Stop masturbating. Yo. <laughs> That's tough. Does it feel different than Proving Ground? Yes. The shot you miss in Proving Ground, you making here. Rebound. <laughs> Spade. The pass. You gonna hit that claw? One more. Yo, if he would have went out. Let's go. One Hmm. Ah, that's tough. Get these. Get past. That's all. It, it's open though. Did you see what I did right there though? That was IQ. That was IQ right there. Good game. Facts. Let's go, man. Let's go. Let's go. Bro, how you got two bills that's in the 90, though? Like, what are you doing? Is that wreck? Wreck. Um, the other shit. Um, Proving Grounds 5v5. Mm. Proving ground give you get rep. I mean, I play it, but I don't ever look at rep. 